as a country where the constitution does not allow the organization of an army. The Japan Self-Defense Forces remain one of the best equipped in the region. Article 9 of Japan's constitution states, aspiring sincerely to an international peace based on justice and order. The Japanese people forever renounce war as a sovereign right of the nation and the threat or use of force as means of settling international disputes. In order to accomplish the aim of the preceding paragraph, land, sea, and air forces, as well as other war potential, will never be maintained. The right of belligerency of the state will not be recognized. However, a part of the constitution was added that the country could build and maintain its inherent right to self-defense. Thus, with the security treaty that Japan signed with the United States in 1951, it allows Japan to maintain a garrison in response to external aggression, as well as internal threats and natural disasters. It started with the National Police Reserve from 1950 consisting of 75,000 men armed with light weapons. Then the Coastal Security Force was born two years later. This force was later renamed the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force and the Maritime Self-Defense Force on July 1, 1954, while the third force, the Air Self-Defense Force, was also established on this date. Japan's shift in defense policy is driven in part by China's rapid military modernization. Chinese Coast Guard ships regularly appear in the disputed islands between Japan and China. Those changes forced then Prime Minister Shinzo Abe to amend the self-defense provisions in the country's constitution. Accordingly, Japan's defense budget has increased significantly since 2012 after many consecutive years of cuts. Specifically, Japan spent $65 billion on defense in 2020. Over the past few years, Japanese defense planners have focused on the development of military forces. The annual White Paper emphasizes this issue with the goal of protecting the remote islands, specifically the disputed Senkaku Islands between Okinawa and Taiwan. In 2018, the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force Rapid Amphibious Deployment Brigade was established. This is a force similar to the U.S. Marines, allowing the military to effectively and quickly conduct defensive operations across the country. Recently, Japan has also actively focused on investing in the space sector for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance. In May 2020, Japan established its own space operations squadron with an initial number of 20 people. The unit is also part of the Japan's Air Self-Defense Force and is expected to grow to 100 people by 2023. This new unit plays an important role in the development of hypersonic weapons that Japan is pursuing.
In recent years, Japan has been evaluated as a country possessing many of the world's leading defense technologies, not even inferior to military powers such as the US and Russia. Regarding the army, Japan has developed domestic tanks and self-propelled guns, which are highly appreciated for their combat power. The main bunch of the Japanese ground self-defense force is currently the top 10 main battle tank, manufactured by Mitsubishi Heavy Industry Corporation to supplement and gradually replace the Tab 74 and Tab 90 tanks. With the price of up to $9.4 million per unit, this is one of the most expensive tanks in the world today. Along with that, the strengthening of the Tab 16 maneuver combat vehicle shows the great investment of Japan in defense. The Tab 16 MCV's primary role is to provide direct fire support to infantry units, which can engage hostile armor vehicles, as well as buildings and fortifications. Improved mobility was also a factor that pushed Japan to develop the Tab 19 World Self-Propelled Hawkwisher. The Tab 19 used the chassis of the German Man 8x8 heavy truck. The vehicle's specifications have not been announced, but it is likely that the Tab 19 inherits the 155mm cannon of the Tab 99 tracked self-propelled Hawkwisher. Japan has purchased seven more Tab 19s in the 2020 defense version. Besides, the country is also developing a new tracked amphibious vehicle to replace the current AAV-7. Japan is also mastering the technology of developing aircraft carriers after successfully upgrading the Izumo class helicopter destroyers that can carry and deploy the F 35 fighter jets. Tokyo owns many advanced classes of destroyers, such as Maya, Atago, and Congo, all equipped with Aegis combat systems like the US Alibur class. In addition, the Akishuki class destroyers still have remarkable combat power. Tokyo also possesses full technology to develop other types of warships, such as corvettes, amphibious ships, transport ships. In addition to Izumo, Japan has two more smaller Hyuga-class ships. Regarding submarines, Japan, along with Germany, are now considered the world's two leading manufacturer of diesel and electronic-powered attack submarines. Tokyo is known for its Shoryo and Oya Shio classes, with a full displacement when submerged up to 4,200 tons. The Shoryo has a top speed of about 35 km per hour and a range of more than 11,000 kilometers, while achieving extremely no-noise levels. The Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force has also commissioned its first non-nuclear submarine, the JS Oryu, powered by lithium-ion battery for longer and safer underwater operations. This is an important step forward for Japan's next-generation submarine. After years of using the American P-3 Orion anti-submarine reconnaissance aircraft, Japan developed the Kawasaki P-1 to replace it. 
Since 2000, Japan has also cooperated with the US to develop the Mitsubishi F2 fighter as a separate version of the famous F-16 series. Japan is also an important partner in the F-35 Stealthy Fifth Generation Fighter project initiated by the US. Up to now, after receiving the F-35, Tokyo is also pursuing a program to develop the Mitsubishi F-3 fighter, equivalent to the F-2 Raptor that the US does not export. Japan maintains a large air defense identification zone around its territory, and its interceptors are regularly tasked with identifying and monitoring intruding foreign military aircraft. Along with the F-15J and F-35 fighters, Japan is also developing a new generation of fighters to replace 87 Mitsubishi F. Two A B Manteron fighters. In October 2018, then Japanese Defense Minister Takeshi Iwaya announced that the country would purchase nine more E2Ds, totaling 3,135 billion dollars, to replace the aging E2C fleet. Earlier. Japan decided to buy 17 more MV-22 Osprey helicopters to supplement the amphibious force being built with the help and effective advice of the US.